Thank you for tuning in for my weekly video blog. I'm Avery Fricks, proudly representing McIntosh and Muskogee counties. Another week here at the Capitol. Last week was our deadline week to get all the bills from the House to the Senate. And so now this week we've started hearing Senate bills. We have heard several of the Senate bills in committee so far. Also working a lot on the budget this week as well. Additionally, the Speaker has a plan that he's going to be announcing next week regarding the teacher pay raise plan. This would be a plan that, that would pay for the $1,000 teacher pay raise the first year, $2,000 pay raise the second year, and $3,000 the third year. But we also need to be looking at our state employees and make sure that the way, there are competitive wages uh, for our state employees as well. The budget is, is an ongoing process. Last week we, we met with our subcommittees. This week we're going to continue that work uh, with the transportation uh, subcommittee and looking at ways that we can be more creative and, and, and still get the same quality projects here in the state of Oklahoma. Also, it was a privilege to have two pages up here this week. We had uh, Kylie Henderson from uh, Shakota, Oklahoma, and we also had Kylie from Warner. And so it was great to have them here at the Capitol this week. Also, we had the Warner Leadership Class along with Misty uh, Durrett and Jeremy Jackson from Warner Public Schools here at the Capitol. It was great to have them. Also, we recognized several students from Connor State College in Muskogee for their outstanding achievements. It was a privilege to have them here at the Capitol. As always, please feel free to come by and visit anytime. Room 328, be at the Capitol. If I can serve you in any way, please do not hesitate to reach out. Contact me on my cell phone. I've made my cell phone number public, call, text, anytime, email, Facebook, whatever is most convenient for you. Thank you for tuning in, and I hope you'll tune in for next week's video blog, and thank you for allowing me to serve the great people of the District 13.